Today in our 2013 Kia Sportage, we're doing a test fit of the Yakima Holdup Platform Style 2 bike rack. That part number is Y02443. Now we already have our bike secured down. We're first going to show you one of the key features of this rack. We're going to come here to the back, slightly lift up on our bike rack and pull out on our red pin. Once we pull that out, we're able to tilt our bike rack away from our vehicle with our bikes fully loaded. And you'll see we're going to gain full access into our back hatch area to get anything in or out that we may need. What's great about this is that we don't have to worry about removing our bikes or our bike rack just to gain this access. We'll close that up and to put our bike rack back into place, we'll simply lift up until that clicks. As for how our bike is secured down, here at the back we have a ratchet strap. We're going to push on the, or pull up on the red button to release that and pull up on the black portion to tighten that down. At the front we have a wheel hook. This is going to sit either in front of our brakes or in front of our frame, depending on how our bike is made. Push on the red button at the bo bottom to release that. Pull straight down to ratchet that down. And this does has, have a cable lock at the top to help prevent theft and tampering. Take our bike off, move it out of the way, and we actually have a uh, more compact position to put our bike rack into. We'll take our front wheel cradle towards the back, tilt our back wheel cradle on top, then we'll take our hook all the way to the opposite side and ratchet that down. That's going to hold everything in place. Now we can take a few measurements. First is going to be overall what we're adding to our vehicle. It's going to be about 27 inches. Ground clearance is going to be about 15 and a half inches. And our closest point is going to be about two and three quarter inches. Now we do have the option to fold this bike rack up against our vehicle. Pull out on that pin once again. Our bike rack folds up and this is going to be great for close quarter situations like parking because we're only adding about eight inches to our vehicle. Now as for our hitch, this is designed to work with two inch hitches only. We have an anti-rattle bolt and lock. That lock's going to help to prevent theft and tampering. While that anti-rattle bolt, when completely tightened down, is going to keep a lot of shake and play out of the bike rack as you head down the road. So that's going to be our completed look at the Yakima Holdup Platform Style 2 Bike Rack, part number Y02443 on our 2013 Kia Sportage. Here it is on our test course. We'll start by going through the slalom. This is going to show us the side-to-side -side action, which simulates turning corners or evasive maneuvers. Next, we're at the alternating speed bumps, which we'll see the twisting action. This will simulate hitting a curb or pothole or driving over uneven pavement. Finally, we have the full speed bumps, where we'll see the up and down action, which is just like driving out of a parking lot, garage, or driveway. Click the link below to shop, learn more, or visit us at eTrailer.com.